Hi friends! So I've got another big stack today, so we know what time it is. Um, I have gotten in a Neo Geo package, um, and I've gotten in a couple, yeah, a couple really big trades. So <laughs> I have a ton of cards to store away, and I'm very excited for it. Um, a few caveats first. I had to go out and get more clear sleeves, so there are going to be some cards that need clear sleeves and haven't been set up for yet. So we're going to do that on camera. Um, I feel like there was something else I was going to say, but I can't remember. So, oh, um, if I do this the way I want to do this, then this video will come up after my Purple Kiss video. So I don't have any Purple Kiss cards yet. They're all still on the way to me. All right. Now let's go. First up, simply because I haven't done it yet, um, we're going to be putting away a freebie. I don't think I've shown this. This is my um, little binder where I put freebies that people make, like the um, Polaroids. I really like the Polaroids. And then I really like clear cards. Um, I know this one is not a freebie. It's just clear, so it's in there. But it is sleeved. It's the only one that's sleeved. Um, I got this clear card, so I'm just going to stick her right here. Cool. All right. So up first is going to be Itzy. And I did, um, like try to not double sleeve, not double side. Um, so everything is single side now. And I thought that it was going to like make my binders bigger but it actually made them smaller which is so weird like to think about for me because it's more pages it's just the size is smaller so the first one i have is this leah for not shy i really love like this whole set um like all of them for the yellow backs, so I'm very excited to get the yellow backs. But we have her. Then for Guess Who, I have... Oh, not on this page. Oh, that's right, because this one is still coming. I have Rujin's Hidden Card. So now we'll be able to see the backs of those. And I have Yuna's... Um, crystal ball and so we'll be able to see the backs of these which I'm excited about because the backs of these cards are so pretty get in there I am hoping to like once I'm able to clear sleeve some other stuff also clear sleeve I mean they're already clear sleeve but like dragon shield sleeve um my Etsy collection so that they're not like floating around in the pockets for Crazy in Love, I have this Yeji phone, feeling like a boombox. Ha! So that Yeji phone card, and I have Yeji and Leah's selfie cards. So that means that this page is complete. Cute. And then I also have Cherry Young's phone card. And Rujin's mirror selfie card. Yay! They're gonna look so good when they're done. And when they're sleeved and not... I mean, they're sleeved, but you know what I mean. Um, then I have Leah's selfie selfie card. The signature back. And normally, I would put the signatures in the middle. That's what I like to do. But I really like the lollipop cards. And I also really like putting my favorites in the middle. So, back and forth. I also have this Yeji for the cookie cutter cards. And Rujin and Cherry Young for the selfies. Cool. We made a lot of progress on Crazy and Love today. That's exciting. I don't know where this is. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. So there's Crazy in Love for Checkmate. 
I have every heart card except for Yeji. Boop, boop, boop. Nice, good. And then for our pink page, I have Rujin for the cheek book. Cheshire, I'm still making like very little progress with. I have one Leah selfie. So signature, middle. And then I have Yeji and Rujin's neon cards. And that's it. <laughs> so at least the neon cards are complete. Um, I have one unit on the way, and that's Cheryoung and Yuna. Then for Kill My Doubt, I have this super cute Yuna, um, boxer one. I'm not really sure what to call those, but I have that Yuna. And then I have Yeji here, and... I have a Chair Young and Leah unit on the way, but I also have Yuna, so I'm only missing Rujin for that. That is Kill My Doubt done. I have, n oh, I did switch up my Born to Be um, layout like I said that I wanted to. So the four are right here, and then these two are empty for right now. But I like it better that way. Um, I do have. Chair Young's Barnes and Noble um, Polaroid. So now I just need something to put there. Because the um, hoodie cards are going to go up here, and I should have Rujins on the way. And that is that. So now I have one Yua card. It is another Dun Dun Dance card. So this one. Wait, no, I don't. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. I must have had the wrong one marked off on my wish list. <sighs> oh well. Well, never mind, I don't have any Yua cards today. Dun Dun Dance gets me. Okay, so that is it for this binder. We're gonna go into Idol now. Alrighty. So at the time I'm filming this, Oogie's pre-release, could it be came out yesterday, and it's cute. I like it. I'm excited to see the rest of... I think it's a mini album? I can't remember, but I'm excited to see the rest of the songs. Um, I also wanted to single-side idle for no real reason other than I have decided that I do like seeing the backs of cards. So yeah, that's fun. Um, but I don't really have a place for these tarot cards, so I'm putting them sort of in the middle of places. And like Minnie's works, because this is La Tata, but there are no photo cards for Han era, and so I put Shu out there. Now, I do have one card for I burn and that is this Uki. I remember complaining last time that Boogie was like the hardest member for me to collect and then someone offered to trade a bunch of their Oogie cards because they were dropping their Oogie collection for some cards that I had and so now I have a bunch of Oogie cards so thank you I appreciate it then here I have Mion for the, I think it's the spoiled, no, the risky set. I think this is the risky set because I'm pretty sure this is spoiled and I have Oogie for this version. And I have her for the chill version. Very nice. Cool, I'm happy with that. 
I also have a couple of these like film evidence cards. So I have this red mini. Try to get her in the middle. And this red oogie. Oh, I messed up. For some reason I thought I had the pink oogie on the way, but I did not. It was the red one. <laughs> Alright, so there's our film evidence progress. And for I love, we have this oogie. And I should have this oogie coming from somewhere else, but I don't know if they've sent out yet, so I have to like check on that. And this oogie. As long as that other one comes, then I will be finishing Oogie's regular, um, like, main album photo cards for I Love. And I have both of these. I don't really think that there are any comebacks for me to talk about. So I guess this is kind of a quiet um, storing video. Nice. All right. Now for I feel, we have Shua, actually. <laughs> so Shua. So we are done with the, excuse you, Polaroids for the cat version. Yay! And then I also have Oogie with the bunny, the bunny plushie. So here she goes. So I'm only missing Soyeon. Soyeon, come home. Nice. Alright. Then for the butterfly version, I have this mini, whoopsies, um, selfie so that we can finish up this page. And then I have, take one guess, Oogie! Um, oh cool, so we're finishing the Polaroids. No, we're not. I didn't even notice that that shoe up just wasn't, that's a filler. And I have this Soyeon. This Oogie. And Oogie's ID. How many times am I going to say Oogie? Trust me, it's a lot. There she goes. Her ID card looks different than theirs. Oh well. Ooh, so I'm only missing these two shoes to be done. Because that's done. Ah, oh, pretty. <laughs> Then here I have these um, polka card and her QR card. Oh, you'll probably notice I did take out the, um, what are they called? The polka slash jewel case cards for the cat version and the queen version. I don't know if I'll put them back. I might. We'll see what happens. Here is where things are sad because I got in that Neo Geo package and after I opened that Idol Queen album, um, the I Feel album, I realized that every single photo card was fake. Every single one. I'm so sad because I love that Soyeon and that Soyeon. I had already used this Soyeon to, um, cause like I've said before, I take the fillers and write my thank you notes on the back to reuse them. 
And so I'd already done that. Um, and, like, sent it off in a trade. So, I no longer have that filler. <laughs> and I'm not just going to print another one. So, that this one's going to stay empty for a little bit. Same with that mini. I was so sad. Anyway. But I do have this Oogie. Well, I have Oogie's whole set. So. The crowns are really cute. There we go. Very nice. Alright. And then, for the photo book version, I also have this Ugi, which is super exciting. I love this card. This one in the matching. Actually, I just love this whole set right here. I think this is probably my favorite set of photo book cards. Nothing for heat. Then for Super Lady. Um... I have this mini for the zero version. This mini was just sent out today. I received sending proof, and so I'm only missing the zero version me on. Because I have these two oogies. <laughs> so zero version oogie. And two version Oogie. So this page will be done. That's exciting. There she goes. Very nice. And then I did leave this here because I do still want like an OT5 set with the mirror balls. Um, I did take it down to just Mion and Soyon for the polka and the jewel case right now because they're all just so similar and the only reason I was collecting many was to make it a nice three layout and I didn't want to do that but I was trying to like decide because I was like okay I'll just collect one for polka jewel case we'll see how it goes but I could not decide between Sion and Neon so yeah um and then I don't have any, like, exclusives. I do have... Oh, that Soyon's new. It's a... I don't know what kind of pop for my love. But she's there. But I do have this Mion US exclusive for I feel. So for the moment, it's just going to go right here. And then I didn't have a place for Lion or Senorita. Since the photo cards for Senorita were large. And... There's just no photo cards for Lion era, so I just put that one there. I might put Lion with, oh my god, but we'll see. Cool, so that is the idol portion. Now we're going to go into Red Velvet, and I also have a lot of cards for Red Velvet. I was, again, really lucky in that I made a pretty big trade. Um, and then somebody was selling Red Velvet cards for a dollar on Instagram, so I went ahead and bought them, and it looks like they're real. <laughs> so we're going to see what happens. Um, but first, I have this Windy Bad Boy Kino. Same back as the other Bad Boy cards. So this is the random one. I actually have all of Windy's Kinos now. Gosh, 2018, that was so long ago. Gosh. Anyway. Nothing for RBB for day one. I have this Joy. I don't know exactly which set she goes with, so I'm going to put her up there. And then nothing for day two yet. Oh. But for, actually, with these, like, last two cards, I'm up to date with Wendy for, oh, which one went where? I think this one goes up top. For um, Red Velvet out 
album cards up to Chill Kill. So I'm caught up to current era with Wendy and Solgi. That's two Red Velvet members. I can count. I also have this joy. Oh, and another joy. I have multiple joy. So, I think that one... I can't remember where these joys go. I can't remember, like, the finale cards sets. So they're just going to go wherever I want them to. And then I hopefully have this joy on the way. No, maybe this joy was supposed to go there, and I have that joy on the way. I don't know, can't remember. Fix it later. Or someone can tell me. Um, then I'm also finishing this page for Queendom. So I have the last joy I needed, and the last two Yeris I needed. So all I need for Queendom is Irene. Who would have guessed? I love this Yeri photo card. She's so pretty. There we go. This page looks very good. And for Feel My Rhythm, I have these two. So this is the Orgel version. So this joy will go up here. And this joy will go here. So I'm only missing Yeri for the Orgel version, and I should have this Yeri on the way. Ooh, for birthday. So I did decide to switch around um, the first page, how I set it up, because it used to be like four pages, one set per page. But in that trade I made, I also got these two Japanese cards. So I decided to put Bloom on top before birthday. So Wendy and Yeri. And then I have Yeri's regular photo book card about time. Because I know that these regular photo book cards were not hard. So that set is complete. Then for the cake set, I have Joy. Awesome. Okay. I'm debating seeing if I can try to get like a pop set or something, or maybe one of those trading card sets to put at the bottom. That way it'll fill out as well. Then for Chill Kit. So we have this poster version, Solgi. Um, and then I have these two, what I call the sister version. I don't know if they're actually sister version, like, photo cards. Like, they're in the sister version, um, whatchamacallit, outfits, but I don't know if they're, like, actual sets or not, because on my template, they're not. And then I also have my only elemental version, which is Wendy. Then for the poster version, I have Joy. And I have Yeri. And they bop. Very nice. Making progress for the package version. I have this Wendy, which I'm going to put up here for right now. And then, wait. Why are these the same? <laughs> I lied, this is the S mini. Gosh darn. Well, whoops, I got confused. Okay. Then for the bag version, I know these are the bag version cards. I have Wendy and Joy, and I can't remember which one goes together because they both have the same back. Um. Like this? I don't know. I'll fix it later. 
I am apparently really struggling with my wish list. Actually, no. I know that the person who offered it said it was the package version card, but I think because they're so similar, we all just got confused. <laughs> okay. So, here are the bag versions, and then I should have Yeri's bag version cards as well. And I also have Yeri's S Mini. So, that means that I'm only missing Solgi, Irene, and then Irene's S Mini. Yay. And then I did decide to set up the unit slash solos differently. So, I have them just on their own page essentially. So, Monster, and then Irene, Irene. I just don't have fillers for her. Ooh, for Wendy. I am finishing like water today, aside from the limited PCs, but you know, you know. So like water is done. And I had it to where Wendy was going to be at the end, like her solo comeback, because that's chronological, but I didn't like that. And I wanted her solos to be together. So I have that there. And I have this photo book card. So she's going to go here for right now. Also, for some reason, I thought that there were like three photo book versions, two QRs and then that one thing, and then two um, package versions, and I knew all of those, and then I saw this card with teddy bears, and I was like, where did you come from? Turns out there are three package version cards, and I'm just dumb. <laughs> so, that was fun to find out. I don't have any Solgi solos today, also. I just put those three on the back for right now, and then hopefully, eventually I'll get pobs, but they're not high prio. So yeah. Forgot the beat. I have every Wendy card except for one, and I have no idea how they go together, so. Got the beat has ten cards, which does not work well for a nine pocket. Um, so I have this Solgi paired with this Wendy. This Solgi will be with this Wendy. This Solgi is with this Wendy for the moment. I don't know if this is actually correct. And then this Solgi I have paired with this Wendy. Cool. And then on the back, I have the two S mini cards. And with Solgi's S mini just in the middle right now. So as many as many. So that's how I'm setting up Got the Beat for the moment. And I also finally have Sogi's Sappy photo card. So I'm done with her Japanese photo cards until they release another one. Yay! There she is. Cool. Then we're going to flip to the back because I have set up a Wendy extras page. So I have Wendy's day one Kino card. There's her day two card. I have her SMCU 2021. I can't remember which version it is. I don't think it's the red velvet version. I think it's like the whole version, like all of them. I should have cards coming in there. And then, because I only have one card, I also have this Joy SMCU, and she's going to go here. Because I'm not setting up for SMCU right now, because I don't care about it yet. So, <laughs> we are finally done with our Red Velvet update. It was quite a lot of cards, mainly because of that big trade. Yes, exciting. Okay, Luna next. Four... Luna. In my Neokyo unboxing, um, I got Chu and Goan's unit album, and it came with Goan's attendance card. So she's gonna go here in her heart sleeve. Cool. Then, still waiting on those. I need to flip all the way to here because I have a Chu A 
version midnight card. Yeah, there we go. Midnight A version card. So she goes there. You have no idea how much I want to get rid of this binder and move them into another Meow Cafe one. But the Meow Cafe ones are kind of expensive. And, like, I need to wait for that. I need to wait. I have to, like, convince myself. Um, but also, I don't think anyone would want this just because, like, the pages are cloudy and you can, like, see where I do this to try and get the stuff out and yeah so I don't know what I'm gonna do with these binders I have this B version Hyunjin so yeah and then nothing until and where I have this D version Hyunjin I don't think she's with the right set but this is my, like, set without flowers, except for, you know, the members where all three of their photo cards have flowers, so, yeah. But yes, that is it for this binder. I have a few photo cards for the next one. So, try to get it in. Up first. For flip that, I dropped this binder, and now they're all like all over the place. I have this Hyunjin. Right next to Hyunjin. And then this Hyunjin. I'm so excited for Lou Semble's comeback. I think I've said that a bunch now, but we're gonna say it again. And Artemis. Ah. And then we have this Vivi. And I'm just waiting for Chu to announce a comeback. Because I know she will. Um, and I also have this Jinsel. It's such a cute card. Look at her. And I have this Eve. There she goes. I love having like all four of them. It looks great. Okay, so that is it for this one. Next, we get to move into Post Luna. Nothing for Artemis today. Oh, but I do have a Heejin. I got another bookmark. So that's cool. I would like to get the other two bookmarks. Um, for Lucemble, we have this go on today. I'm debating about also clear sleeving these. I know I'll probably say that I don't want to. Not clear sleeving. You know what I mean. Um, like single siding these. I'll probably say that I don't want to just because, you know, the backs are the same. <laughs> and then I'll probably end up doing it anyway. So, like, don't listen to me. Um, and then you have Yojin for the dream version. And nothing for the space version, but I do have this go on for the ever music version. And that is it for this binder today. Okay, so this is actually the second time that I'm filming this segment because it has been a saga. So I, I like talked to my boyfriend and essentially asked him, I was like, am I being hypocritical about this? because I had seen comments saying that. And we talked through it, and he was like, I understand your reasoning, but maybe yes. Because my reasoning for not collecting, like, Unche or Iso or all of that was because 
they were born after a certain date and so the age gap itself was big it isn't the fact that like she is currently a minor if i were closer in age to her that wouldn't like matter as much like if i were still like 19 and she's 17 great it's the age gap that like gets me sometimes because i am closer in age to Wan young and eugene and people keep bringing up that like they i collect them in 2018 when they were 15 and all that but i was also younger in 2018 so like that's how age works what do you mean but we talked about it and i was like okay so maybe maybe it is a little weird there's no reason, like, I think there's a good reason, but maybe, whatever. And so I set up for NJ. And then I got this really, like, I don't know, I don't think they were trying to be mean, but it sounded very rude comment. And I was like, you know what, never mind. And so I, then I just unset up for NJ because I was, like, upset. Not upset, but... Can no. The feeling is weird because I was like, "What are you even talking about?" But whatever. So, I took a little time, and so now. Now. I am not really setting up for Unche, or Iso or whatever, but. I have the cards that I still have in here. And if I see some other cards that are really cheap, maybe I'll get them. And that's my compromise. So, for what I currently have. Also, I wanted to take them out of that four pocket binder, the Ultra Pro, because the Ultra Pro just... I don't like them. I don't like them. And so, I put them in here. And I do really like the five pattern in here, and the six pattern, if we think about five. But... I do have Kazua for the blue Chypre, however you want to say it. So that is technically, I mean, that's complete, which is cool. Um, and then nothing until the compact for Anti-Fragile, where I have this Yunjin. So she will go there. Nothing here, nothing here. I have the water bottle Yunjin, compact for Unforgiven. Um, I did decide to put uh, the like units over there. So that's fun. And then we see units there as well. Then for easy, I have this Sakura, the sheer myrrh version. Every time I hear myrrh, I think about the vine. Um, the I brought you frankincense, thank you. And I brought you myrrh, thank you. Murder, Judas, no. Like, every time I hear sheer myrrh, that just plays through my head. Because I used to love vine. I mean, I still do, but you know, it's dead, so like... I also have Sakura's compact version, and I have Chewan's QR code, so she will go there. And then down here, I can't remember exactly what I'm putting, but I think it's a pop set. <laughs> um, I have everyone except for Yoonjin for one of the sets. So then for the, um, whatever this is called, the Weverse, like, card thingies, I do have Unche in here because I already had her. So, I think it looks good. And I didn't want to put just all of these away, especially since they're, you know, like, concept, not really even photo cards, but whatever. And then I'll put the units there. So one unit, two unit. Three unit, four unit, and then the group cards, because I have five. So there we go. 
for I've, I've done kind of the same thing. If I end up getting, like, seeing Liz or ESO cards for cheap, then I guess they'll go in. So, the first card I have is four. Oh, this, like, setup, I'm hoping it will be temporary, unless I do end up collecting, like, OT6 Ive. Um, and for the Seraphim as well, because I would like to get another Meow Cafe for Pocket Finder to put them in, but maybe I'll do a five Pocket Finder? I don't even know. But I do have this Ray Loved Ive version. So she will go in there. And I have a trade set up for that Eugen, so I should be missing one of each. No, two rays. I'm missing two rays and then one Eugen and one Wanyoung. Because I'm still missing that ray. Just in time for the comeback. So then this page. This is just what I have. I kept the full set for the Prom Queens DVD I bought. And then I had this ray for the season's greeting, so I put that up there. The US exclusives that I still have, I still have never found Wanyoung for, you know, a good price. But. And then here are the other season's greetings that I had three for. So yeah, there we go. That is how I am setting up. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Seraphim and Ive for right now. So, yep. Alright, next part. Okay. I have nothing for Unbi today. I don't have a whole lot for this binder, actually. My first thing is for Yenna. I did get her good morning photo cards. So these are my three pulls. They're so cute. And like, the urge for me to single sleeve these cards as well is also pretty high. Um, but I counted how many I have, slash how many are also on the way, and it's like 537 or something. And I am like, mm, maybe not. Because then I probably end up needing a whole nother binder. And we can't do that financially yet. I mean, we could, but I have other things that I should pay for. So. I do have two cards for Over the Moon for Che- Nope. The Move Street for Cheon. I have this kit card. And then I also got another pre-order for her. And this one is so cute. Look at her. I love her. So, very excited with that. Ah, she's so cute. Alright, um, I still, I'm still looking for, like, a POV template for the Move Street, because the person that I normally use hasn't updated hers for a while, so I think that, you know, she's just pretty busy. Um, so I'm still looking for a POV template. But... That's it. No Yuri today, unfortunately. So now we get to move on to Eyes 1. And for Eyes 1, boop, boop, boop. Uh -huh, they look so good. I love them. Um, first card is for Blue Eyes, since both Color Eyes and Heart Eyes are done. Still nothing for the I Will version. I'm so close to finishing it. It's only like seven cards. And yet, those seven cards elude me. I see some of them, but not for prices I want to pay. So up first, I have this Chewan. Not QR. AR. AR card. For the I Am version. Only missing Yuri and Yujin. Then have this Yuri card. So she will pop in here. Beautiful. 
and this chain one. Eh, maybe I have this chain one. There we go. So in she goes. Nice. Um, and that's it for this binder. That's it. Just those cards. The rest of what I have is two Oniric Diary and two One Railer cards. Okie dokie. Last binder. So pretty. <laughs> um, sorry, sometimes I see it in like the camera and I just get happy, I guess. So we have this Chewan today, so that, I was about to say that finishes this set, but it does not. I'm still missing Yujin and Wanyoung. Yay. All right. Then, I have, this is the set I'm finishing. I have this Chewan, so that we can finish up the dress set. So this whole spread is complete now. Look at them go. Nothing for that one. <laughs> Who knows? Um, then for one reeler, I have scene one, one young. She's so pretty. Awesome. And I have seen three Eugen right here. Who's going to tell me that these two are not correct? Yuri and Eugen are messed up. You are all just going to watch me be an idiot, which is valid, but also, come on. There she goes. Okay. No, I don't like that. I like it when they're at the bottom. I don't know why. There was one time where I was talking with one's glassy, um, and I was like, whining is my permanent state, like resting, you know, not nice face. Um, and I feel like it's true. I feel like I just whine a lot. Anyway, Yuri and Eugen. Now they're correct. There we go. All right, cool. And that is it. That was the last photo card I had to put away. Um, I would like to show you a postcard that I got. So if you are not into large inclusions, bye-bye. And if you are into large inclusions, hang tight. Oof. Okay. We have not seen this binder in a little bit. And I don't normally share my large inclusion binders, especially Eyes of One, because Eyes of One is a four inch large inclusion binder and it's big. So, we get to go basically all the way to the back. Isn't that exciting? You get to watch me flip through like everything. Do you like the sound effects? I think that sound effects make things better. So I did get Unbee's full, excuse you, Unbee's um, Polaroid and bookmark set from the Daikon Japan. And then I also got all of these postcards for one, the story. And this is Oniric Diary. Whoopsies. This is not one of the story. Well, I got this postcard. This unit postcard. This is one of the last things that I need for Cheon. I'm still missing a few more postcards and a few more photo cards, but she needs to be moved. Let's move this back. I need to get one of my, like, four pocket that goes like that. To put these two in but this binder has so much stuff in it and I do not take a whole lot of time 
to try and make it look pretty just because there's so much. So much stuff. All right, so New York Theater was around here. Yeah, here we go. So, I don't know if you're gonna fit in a four pocket, but you will fit in a two pocket. So if all else fails, oh, oh, it sticks out a little. I don't want it to get hurt. It's gonna go here. Okay, there we go. If you would be interested in like watching me try and organize all of this and make it look pretty, let me know because maybe if I do it on camera, it'll motivate me to do it. <laughs> Who knows? Alrighty, thank you so much for watching if you made it this far. I'm not gonna make you watch me flip all these pages again because it's kind of painful to watch, but yeah, thank you. Um, have a good day, week, month, year, or life if you never watch me again, and happy collecting. Bye!